Welcome back trainers and in this video we're going to be going over the Pokemon Horizons event which is going to be the introduction to Charcadet and we're going to be taking a look to see how rare it is going to be for each egg. Oh yeah you better believe it we're going to see a whole another one of these uh, Larvesta situations going on maybe I don't think it's going to be that bad hopefully not let's get into this without wasting any more of your time it's going to be going down March 5th at 10 a.m. until March 11th at 8 p.m. and you're going to be actually be able to watch the new show on March 7th or after if you're in the West on Netflix and then if you're in the UK it's going to be on something else at BBC uh, you know I don't watch these shows or anything but I just might light one up and uh, watch that we'll have to see bonuses are going to be times 2 XP for catch or hatching Pokemon and then team go rocket balloons will be appearing more frequently no you cannot TM away frustration all right, so here you go. This is going to be the debut of Charcadet. So to get either one, you're going to have to equip it as your buddy. And then you're going to have to either battle or defeat 30 psychic type Pokemon. You don't have to use the po you don't have to use Charcadet. Just have to make sure it's your buddy, okay? It's going to be going up and or 30 ghost type Pokemon for either one. Okay? So you're going to have those routes to go down there and yeah okay so you're also going to be seeing the new costume pokemon pikachu wearing the captain hat and it's also going to have a special feature move volt tackle it's not really doing too much i mean it's a decent move what are you going to do with pikachu little cup that's it i don't really care about that uh surprise encounters when you do take a snapshot snapshot so make sure you do this you're going to be able to encounter five surprise pokemon you do have charizard which can be shiny Captain Hat Pikachu, which can be shiny. That's going to be pretty nice, so you can get that move on it. Uh, Springatigo and Fue Coco. So make sure you do those if you're looking to get some, uh, maybe a shiny Pikachu or Charizard there. All right, so for the task, you have Spin 5 Pokestops or Gems for those various different items there. Win a raid for those. Defeat two Team Go Rocket Grunts for potentially a shiny Skarmory there. Hatch two eggs for... Maybe you can get yourself a shiny Pikachu out of those eggs. Maybe a Shundo. Who knows? Uh, but there are those tasks on screen there for you. All right. Now, finally, it's just going to be a quick newsflash video, folks. If you do enjoy these types of videos, make sure you do give it a thumbs up. It really uh, does help me out quite a bit. All right. So taking a look at the two kilometer egg, the Charcadet is going to be in the four egg rarity category. So, you know, it is going to be pretty hard to get out of the two kilometer eggs. You might get it on your first hatch. Okay. I already see it now. Somebody's going to comment. I got my first hatch. Excellent. I'm very happy for you. All right. It's, it, you got very lucky. Okay. <laughs> All right. So you have, there you have the two kilometer egg. It's going to be hatching out of two, five and tens. Okay. After the event, it will only be hatching from the 10 kilometer eggs. Now, as far as the rarity, I can't tell you after the event, we'll go over that here in a second. Five kilometer eggs. Rarity is going to be in the three egg category along four other Pokemon. So you do have a good chance to get it there. I mean, you know, hopefully, you know, say you have a batch of five kilometer eggs and you hatch them all at the same time. You, you probably have a good chance to get that in your first run. No, no problem. And then you do have the 10 kilometer egg. This is where it's going to be after the event is over. Now it is going to be in the one egg category alongside several of the Pokemon here. So it is going to be pretty common in the 10 kilometer eggs. Only problem with that is it's a 10 kilometer egg. Also, you do not have any control over what eggs drop out of these stops, okay? Uh, all right, so pretty common in the 10 kilometer eggs. Now I'm gonna give you a few tips here, okay? This is just gonna make your life a lot easier. If you don't have a rocker, I know, I'm not condoning this. I'm just saying it's something out there that you could potentially do. I'm not saying I do it, <laughs> but it's there for you to do. Since Niantic wants to be a little sneaky sneaky, make us spend all this money money, maybe you just can't get out this is how you can do it you take yourself over to amazon you buy yourself a phone rocker and you start getting to rocking now again that's something out there i'm not saying you should do it but there is that option for you to just collect a bunch of eggs let your phone do its little thing but don't rock too much you don't want to go getting stupid with it okay okay <laughs> uh all right, so there you go. There you go, okay? That's the best way to get those eggs hatching if you are a little busy. Um, but then again, if you're busy, just keep your phone in your pocket or if you're driving around, just keep on hatching them. Just do it the legit way. But if you can't get out or whatever the case may be, there you go. Don't know how quick you can get it from Amazon, but hopefully pretty fast. Uh, we got a new little Amazon place here, so we get our packages a lot quicker. But in Alaska, it takes at least a, maybe a week to get our crap. 
Anyways, there you have it, folks. Char Cadet in the 1A category for the 10 kilometers. In the 5 kilometers, it's going to be in the 3A category. And then in the 2 kilometer egg, it is going to be in the 4A kilometer. So the, <laughs> the less kilometers, the harder to hatch, right? As far as after the event, because that's where the Char Cadet is going to be afterwards. Is it going to be in the 1 egg star category for the 10 kilometer eggs? Uh, no, I don't think so. I think they're going to definitely... Uh, up its rarity and probably put it alongside Frigibacks. I don't know if they'll put it against Larvesta, but just make sure you hatch a couple during this event. I mean, this may be the best time to get it right now. Like usual, the fear of missing out, pushing people to go and do these things because, oh no, you might not get it afterwards. But at the end of the day, nobody's forcing you to play, okay? So there's that. Anyways, I just thought I'd bring you that information so you're well aware and uh, you don't know, have too high of expectations. Although, I don't want to get your hopes up, but it looks like you're going to be able to hatch this, okay? It doesn't look like it's going to be super hard. What my last bit of advice is, make sure you clear out all your eggs right now, right now. And then make sure you don't mess around with seven kilometer eggs, the ones out of the gifts. Those don't hatch these at all. So don't worry, don't, don't worry about that. But what you can do if you still want to open up gifts is fill up your egg inventory, then open up gifts. You won't get any 87 kilometer eggs that way. There you have it, folks. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Really do appreciate the support. Really do. Thank you all so much. And I'll catch you next time. Take care. Hey, so you're finally here. <laughs> Fantastic.